Psych! What up though? Yo guys, so this is a part two of the video where I traded a penny to a PS5. So if you haven't seen that video, go check out the first video before you watch this one. But anyways, yeah, so I'm getting a penny and I'm trading it all the way up to get a brand new PS5. Now in the last video, I went on Facebook Marketplace, pawn shops and card shops. We left off on a 10 karat gold chain that weighed 2.6 grams, but we didn't trade a penny just to get a gold chain. We're going for that PS5. And well guys, the adventure starts again. Let's see if we can make some deals and hopefully trade this gold chain. Okay guys, so yo, right now we are at our first stop. We are back at Garden City Pawn. This is like where we started off this is the place we got the michael jordan card but i'm gonna go show them that i have this necklace now 10 karat gold necklace 2.6 grams how you doing is brian here I give you, uh, the card. jordan card yep cool. yep now we're trading up again Can i jump in the game you, you want to jump in it yeah i mean I all right let's do it let's, let's see what you got. we traded all the way up okay to this from a penny from a penny. Okay, that's where it started at. Yes. Okay. 10 karat gold, okay. gold necklace, uh, 2.6 gram. Don't pull it too hard because it might snap right in half. <laughs> CNL exchange. Okay, you yep. went over there and did yep. trade with that. Yep. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so two point, I don't even get away. So you said it was. 2.6 2.6 yep all right yo so marcus right now is he's looking up a deal for me okay he's looking up seeing what he can trade for it i'm pretty excited and kind of sad to see this go i didn't even put it on yet i, I want to put it on i can't even tell if it's on it's on check it out that is the skinniest chain that i've ever worn in my life it's gold baby it's gold oh man i'm getting happy we're going to the jordan wall oh the geo so now we can at least get in okay. keep it in the shoe game perspective in the shoe game this it's, is what we're doing we're it's a pair of yeezys yeah it's a pair of yeezys, yeah. pair of yeezys. mission accomplished okay I mean, if that i'm just trying to keep it i'm trying to keep it in the game gotcha you know what i mean yep and they smell like too so i think that makes the price go up right i mean <laughs> All right, so gold chain for these right here, size 13. That's going to be a hard size. How about this? We'll test them out. How do they look on me? Fire. You know what's so crazy? Is they're still stuffing in the shoe and they actually fit with the, with the stuffing in there. You know what? Let's do it. Cool, man. Perfect. Awesome. Thank you. You're on the road to see, man. I'm telling you. I appreciate this it. It's going to be good. It's going to be a journey. The final, the final episode. Do you guys have a PS5 here? I don't. They come and go and literally like that. So really? They go fast. Absolutely. Dang. How about hey, PS4? And depending on what you bring to the table, you can, maybe I could be your final move. You never know. Okay. You, never you, got, know. you guys heard it right there. So you yeah. said you didn't have box? Uh, yep, let me go get awesome. this. And maybe after PS5, we could uh, start going chunky donkey road, right? <laughs> yeah, no, seriously. Okay, guys, so yo, walking out with the Yeezy 700s right here. Yo, I'm pretty happy with this, okay? We do have a size 13. That ain't fitting nobody, okay? I mean, who knows? All right, and for all you size 13s out there, I'm sorry, okay? I'll give you the respect. You do got a big foot, though. I'd hate to see what you're packing. <laughs> but anyways, huge shout out to Garden City Exchange for hooking me up with this awesome deal. Definitely go check them out if you're in the area. But yo, what is the next trade? Let's get to it. Okay, guys, so yo, we just made it to Former Vintage. I got the Yeezys right here. Let's go inside and see if they're gonna wanna trade for these Yeezys right here. Let's do it. How you doing, man? <laughs> Oh, no mystery boxes today. So I'm uh, I'm doing a trade-up challenge. I started for a penny and I've been climbing my way up. I went from a penny to a Michael Jordan card to Pokemon card to a lot of stuff. Finally got a pair of shoes and I'm wondering if you have anything that I could trade. Yeah, I can take a look at them. Yep, deal. Yeah, yeah, if, it, if they're pretty beat. They, they had them priced, so we went to uh, Garden City Pond. Yeah. Yeah. So they just gave me a value right now for these around like 150. So I'm looking. What should we do? All right, guys. So yo, I'm here with Art right now. Now these are going for around like 200, size 12. Would you trade these Yeezys for these Jordan ones? Let me see these one more time. Yeah. Not gonna lie, they are definitely a little beat. Size 13. I probably I'll do it for you. You'll do it? Yeah. Yo, let's go. Sweet. Thank you so much, man. Perfect, and then we'll ring it up. All right, so yo, I was just asking about how hard it was gonna be to flip these, and sure enough, we got a guy right here who wears size 13. Dang, this was really size 13, look at that. That is crazy. So I'm actually selling these right now for 300 if you were 
before we trade. No, I'm just trying. Trade is over. Yo, guys, we are walking out with the Jordan ones right now. Extremely sweet trade. Again, do not forget to go check out Farmer Vintage. Really dope shop. Someone might buy those Yeezys right there. You never know. Now, what do we trade for these next? Where should we go? I'll figure that out. Let's do it. All right, so we're at home now. Now, instead of going to a sneaker store, I found this extremely cool way on how we can trade these sneakers. So there's this app called Trade Block. Now Trade Block is one of the first apps where you can trade your sneakers through this platform. Even if you guys wanted to use this, the link will be down in the description if you wanna go check it out. It's a pretty cool platform if you didn't wanna just go out and blow your entire check on sneakers. You can trade some of your sneakers that you don't even want, and well, you'll see. Let's go trade these things. So check this out, we're on the app right now. This is my closet. So that's my closet, but this is my wish list. These are all the shoes that I want right now. If you wanna go follow me on there, Connor TV. We already got five followers. Let's go, baby! Like, check this out. All these shoes that I have on here, I'm willing to trade. We got some 700s, foam runners, the CDG Supreme Air Forces. We got some dunk lows and even dunk highs on here. But let me show you how this works. So what I just did, I took some pictures of these shoes. Air Jordan 1 Pine Green 2.0s. Now, if the shoes you list aren't DS, you have to take pictures of them. As you guys can see right here, the estimated value for these things are going for 340 anywhere between 380 Also, down at the bottom, you can see that 50 collectors want these shoes right now. Now I know a shoe that's around the same price range, so I'm gonna look that up. Check these out. So right here, we got the Nike Sakai Blazers. I'm gonna add this to my wish list. I'll just do size 11, condition dead stock, and I'm gonna add those boys. Now check this out. You guys can see that there's four collectors that have these, and one collector that wants them, and I, I think that's me. Now these are going for around 280 to 310. I might want to trade these right here for those. Only because these are used, so it makes the price go down on them a little bit more. But the Sakai's will be DS. I think it would be a smart move. Now check out this seller. They don't have any trades yet, but I'm gonna check them out. Sure enough, they got a size 11 Sakai. I'm gonna click on those and I'm gonna ask to trade from my closet and then see if he wants to trade for these Jordan ones right here. Now it's gonna ask me to review my offer. Now also, you can add cash to your transaction. So let's say you have a shoe that's not worth as much that you're trying to trade. You can add some cash on top of the trade or ask for cash on top of the trade. I'm going balls deep and I'm going for it. I'm gonna send this offer and boom, Check it out, I just asked him if he'll do it. This would be a really cool trade if it ends up going through. Oh man, wait, I got a notification. Let me go. Your trade was confirmed, baby, let's go. Now it's time to print out the shipping label, ship these shoes, and get these Sakai's. Now these shoes are gonna be sent to Trade Block, and once they get them, they're gonna authenticate the shoes, make sure they're legit, and then send them to the trader. Yo, I'm telling you, huge shout out to Trade Block. Again, if you guys wanted to go check them out, the link will be down in the description. Extremely dope app, it's so easy to make trades on there. To be honest, I think it's a really good way to trade your shoes, especially if you don't wanna meet up with a person. But yo, I'm gonna get back to you guys on once I get the Sakai's. Oh my god, that rhymed. That was absolute day for. Yo guys, so right here we just got the shoes off a of trade block. Let me show you these things really quick. We got the Sakai's. These are definitely a unique. I love that dog. He, he looks very, very cute inside that car. I would trade these sneakers for that dog, to be honest. But anyways, definitely a pretty cool shoe right here. They are DS, size 11. But there's a place right here. It's called the Smoke Don. Now, I'm pretty sure they also have sneakers here. I'm not too sure. But let's go inside here and see if they do. And then maybe we could trade for these. Yo, yo, what's going on, man? Uh, do you guys, you sell sneakers? Man, I know you, bro. How you doing? <laughs> My guy, bro. Counter TV. That's right, yep. My guy. Hey, is it cool if we record in here? Yeah, of course. Course, all right, bro. deal. I, all the unboxing video. All Heck that, yeah. I watch it all, bro. Thank you, man. This is dope. Right here for now, man. This is yeah, really, really cool. Extra. So, what I'm doing is I'm doing a trade up challenge. I uh, started at a penny. I'm working my way up to a PS5. This dude, man, always up to something. <laughs> what, what you got for me, bro? So, I, I started, it, it's been a long journey. We, we went from uh, Pokemon cards, Jordan cards, all the way, broken TVs. Necklaces, yada yada. Now we got a pair of Sakai's. Actually, I had that same pair. I sold it too. Really? Yeah. Is okay. It, uh, it's DS. DS size 11. Yep. So I've been looking around the sneaker wall, and let me know if you'd want to work with me. But would you trade for these right here? Those. What size are these ones? Size nine. For my boy, man. You gonna do it? You already know, man. Yo, thank yeah. you so much. You know it, man. Only thank you. With you man. Thank you, thank you. You want to shout out your TikTok, uh, IG? Follow me on TikTok at the Smoke Don, and for the sneakers, it's the Drip Don, and then on YouTube at the Smoke Don, it's the Smoke, 
and then D O N. That's right. You guys might have seen him on TikTok before. What are you at? You already know. Uh, two two thirty five. I got a nice little twenty day ban right now. So follow my backup account. You know, the backup account is the smoke down underscore. Listen, I'm not trying to get any, uh, not trying to get any bad juju, so. Yeah, hey, yeah. Like, no, I'm joking, I'm joking. Hey, <laughs> I'm joking. hey, follow him on TikTok, man. <laughs> Thank you so yeah, much, man. You, I appreciate it. What, what was your name? Oh, uh, Sam. Sam? Yeah, Connor? I, I already know your dad. name, bro. And Pops right here. <laughs> Check this out right here. We got the white Oreo 4s. Yo, these, these are hot. I tried to get these on release day, and of course, El got over here. <laughs> I struck out. But look at that, we got them. I, I might have to try them on. Okay, listen, size nine. My foot will fit in there, but they'll be way too big. I might have to double sock it. Huge shout out to the Smoke Don, all right? This guy is amazing. Definitely go check him out if you're ever in the area. But yo, where to next? There was a place that I went to not too long ago called Sneaker Legends in Dearborn. And I think that's what we're gonna do. So I'll see you guys there. Yo guys, so we just made it to Sneaker Legends. All right, this place is super dope. We're gonna go inside and see if I could trade for these right here. Let's do it. How you guys doing, Habibi? What are we doing today? What's going on, man? This is what we're doing. Um, let's, we can go inside first right, and then. Cool. So I got no tricks today. Okay. All right, <laughs> no, no tricks. I'm doing a trade-up challenge. I started with the penny. From a penny went to a TV that was waterproof. Have you ever heard of a waterproof TV? No. Me neither. So, <laughs> finally made it to sneakers, and now I got these. Nice. So it's like a series, you got a series going on. Yes, okay, cool, so cool. I'm looking to trade up from here. Nice, I know where this is from too. Where? Loose Cannon. No. No? Nope. Local, uh, former? No. You, you will never guess this place. It, I mean, if I keep going, I might. All right, keep going then. Fahrenheit? 313? Nope. Uh, <laughs> what did you trade to get these? That's a better question. Traded uh, a pair of Sakai's. Okay, okay, okay. The Blazers, Blazers. Yeah, Blazer. Okay. Yeah. It's a store? It's a store. Here. Oh, it's oh, a smoke oh, it's, it's smoke yeah, yeah, yeah. Smoked on, yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. The craziest place. What would you be willing to trade for these fours? Uh, I got a couple options that okay. I think might uh, might interest you. Okay. Um, what pairs? I got these uh, off-whites over here. These dunks. Oh, dang. This one's on uh, an 11 and a half. 11 and a half? Yep. These are clean. Yeah, it's a clean pair. These are really, really yeah, clean. Guys, check. Thing. Yeah, seriously, how how are the bottoms on the bottoms are extremely clean. What do you guys think? That's a pretty nice shoe right there. I do like these. These are going for around like four twenty five right there. Yep. yep. That's pretty legit. What are your other options? Um, I'm thinking maybe this gold toe right here. Oh my god, this is a hard choice. This is a really hard choice. But we're we're in the green right now. I'm not gonna lie. We're uh, we're looking pretty good. Do you have another? Another option? I, I got one more I might be able to do. Okay. Got this Dome Becker foam. Oh my gosh. Yeah, these all got the original box and stuff. This I've crazy. never even seen these before in my really life. Clean. So uh, they re-released these. Okay. Um, in this like Dome Becker pack a couple years back. Dang. Um, you know, extremely rare. There's not many to, you know, you know pairs in circulation type of thing. So Seriously, so and you, a you size. Know, you know. Size 13, 13? Yeah. pretty rare size too. Um, oh my gosh. It's up to you. It's a hard choice. I feel like I'm on deal or no deal right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with the off-whites. With off-whites? I'm gonna do the off-whites. I got you. Let's do it. We'll grab it for you. Thank you. you. No thank you, thank you. Please God, you got a please. strong grip. Yo guys, so we are walking out of Sneaker Legends right now with the off-white dunks right here. Rubber dunks. Whenever I say rubber dunks, it always makes me think of rubber ducky. I don't know why, but it just does. Anyways, huge shout out to Sneaker Legends again. Definitely go check them out. Such dope people inside the shop. But instead of going somewhere else, I think, uh... I think I'm gonna meet you guys at home. So guys, we made it all the way up to the off-white rubber dunks. We made it pretty far, okay? We got pretty far in this video. Now those are going for around $400 right now, and the PS5 is $700. So we are more than halfway there. And that is gonna wrap it up for this video. If you haven't yet, make sure you check out Trade Block again, link in description. We are not done until we get that PS5. I am grinding my butt off just to get this. I probably spent more money and gas money than I actually did on this challenge. I've been driving left, right, center, just like the game. I have motivation.